Hey Beyond Science, Mike Chen here. According to NASA, the mystery of the jelly donut rock that appeared seemingly out of nowhere on Mars last month has been solved. The rock had been a mystery as the Mars rover Opportunity photographed it in a spot where the rock had not been present just four days earlier. NASA described it as a white rock with a dark red low spot in the middle. The rock, more than 1.5 inches wide, was named Pinnacle Island. Since it was photographed, it had led to speculations that it was a fungus-like organism or a piece of Martian engineering. According to researchers, that's not the case. Researchers now say Pinnacle Island is a piece of a larger rock which Opportunity broke and moved with its wheel in early January. Further images from the rover revealed the original rock that the rover's wheel must have struck. Opportunity Deputy Principal Investigator Ray Arvidson said in a statement that they could see directly uphill an overturned rock that has the same unusual appearance. Tracks from Opportunity can be seeing and that is supposedly where Pinnacle Island came from. The story took a strange turn at the end of January when Ron Joseph, who describes himself as a neuroscientist and astrobiologist, he filed court papers demanding that NASA do more to investigate the mysterious rock. Joseph asked the judge to order the space agency to closely photograph the rock from several angles, thoroughly examine it, and share that information with the public. In the court papers, Joseph suggests that the rock may not be a rock at all, but rather a fungus-like organism. If so, that would mean opportunity had discovered life on Mars. Of course, just because NASA is claiming that this is not a alien object doesn't mean everyone is buying it. But let me know what you guys think. Did Opportunity really break off a piece of a larger rock or do you think that yes, Opportunity has discovered life on Mars? Let me know in the comments below and guys, please don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you again next time.